Okay, nandito na naman tayo sa aking next video which is the sum of arithmetic sequence. Ito yung topic sa high school o sa grade 8, 9, 10. Kaya lang sa grade 6 may mga tanong ng ganito. So gagamitin natin yung shortcut. Huwag na yung formula nila na doon din na-derive. Okay, so ang shortcut natin pag naghahanap tayo ng sum ng arithmetic sequence is sum is equal to yung first term plus yung last term. Okay? Times, kung ilan yung bilang nila, yung number, hahatiin mo lang, divided by 2. So, yan yung formula natin. Okay? So, gagamitin natin yung formula sa ating first example. What is the sum of the arithmetic sequence? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yung long method, Pag tinatanong yung sum, ipagpa-plus mo lang. Okay? Long method, 1 plus 2 plus 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, saka 8. Kayang-kaya. Pero paano kung ang haba? Up to 100. So, matatagal lang ka. Eh. 15 seconds lang yung tanong. So, kailangan mong alam yung formula. Okay? So, kung ano yung shortcut na gagamitin. So, makinig lang tayo. So, gagamitin natin yung shortcut. Ang sum ng 1 to 8 is yung first, ano yung first natin? Which is 1 plus yung last. Okay, yung last natin is 8. Okay. Multiply by the number. Okay, ilan yung number natin? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, 8. Then, divided by 2. Yung 2 palaging constant nandun sa formula natin. Okay, so 1 plus 8 is 9. Tapos ito, hatiin mo na yan. 8 divided by 2 is 4. So 1 plus 8 is 9 times okay, 8 divided by 2 is 4. So 9 times 4 is 36. So yun na yung lobas na yung sum niya. Hindi mo na kailangan ipagpa-plus. Kasi pag mahaba, hindi mo pwedeng gamitin yan. Okay, ulitin natin para maintindihan natin. Especially, ginagamit to sa grade 5, sa mga grade 6 contest, mabilisan. So, anong gagawin mo? Ipag-plus mo lang. 1 plus 8, 9 times how many? Yung kalahate, 1 half of the number. So, ilan sila? 8. 8 sila. So, hati mo lang yung 8. 4. So, 9 times 4, 36. Walang 15 seconds, tapos na. Okay? So, yan yung formula. Huwag nyo kakalimutan. Ulitin ko. First, yung una natin is 1 plus yung last. Yung last number natin is 8. Okay? Times, ano yung 8? Kung ilan yung bilang nila, divided by 2. Palaging i-divide sa 2. Ahati n. Okay? So, 1 plus 8, 9 times 4 36. Okay? So, next. So, yung next example natin. Ito yung sinasabi ko. Mahaba. Find the sum of the first 100 terms of the sequence. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, up to 100. Ah, di. Kulang na yung time. So, kailangan natin yung formula. Ibus yung oras mo dito sa pagpa-plus. Up to 100. So, kailangan mo yung formula. Ano yung formula natin? Yung first term first term natin is siyempre palaging 1. Kasi yun ang una. 1. Plus, yung last term is siyempre 100. Yung dulo. Okay. Times, ilan yung bilang nila? 1 to 100. So, ibig sabihin 100 lahat. Then, divided by 2. O, yan na yung sisimplify natin. So, 1 plus 100 is 101 100 divided by 2 is 50 okay, Tatimes na lang natin yan Yan na yung answer okay. So 0 times 1 is 0 0 times 0 is 0 0 times 1 is 0 5 times 1 is 5 5 times 0 is 0 5 times 1 is 5 So 0 5 0 5 okay, So yung answer natin is 5 0 5 0 so, 5,050. Pag nag-plus ka niyan, mauubos yung oras mo sa 
pagsusolve. Okay? So, kailangan mo yung formula. Huwag yung kakalimutan. Ulitin ko ulit para maintindihan nyo mabuti. Yung first number is 1 plus yung last number natin kasi 1 to 100, kaya 100 yun. So, first plus last. Okay? Then, N, kung ilan sila lahat. So, 100. Then, divided by 2, yung 2, nandun sa formula natin. So, 1 plus 100 is 101. Times 100 divided by 2 is 50. Tapos, ita times na lang natin. 0, So, 5,050. Okay? So, mabilisan lang. Sa, kasi sa mga entrance exam, sa college, lumalabas din ito. Eh, mabilisan yung mga oras nila na pag-a-answer. So, kailangan alam mo yung shortcut. Okay? Next, paano naman pag pipito sila? Okay, 1 to 7 lang. Gamitin natin yung formula dito para makita nyo. So, kailangan natin yung first term na 1 okay, plus yung last term natin na 7 okay, times yung kwan, magkatabi times yun. Yung, tapos yung bilang nila, ilan yung bilang nila is 7 divided by 2. Pinakita ko yung example dito na 1 to 7 kasi yung 7, hindi siya pwedeng i-divide sa 2. Okay? Hindi siya eksakto. Ang gagawin mo, i-plus mo muna yan. 1 plus 7 is 8 times 7 divided by 2. Instead na ito yung hahati mo yung 7, yung hahati mo na lang yung kabila, yung 8. 8 divided by 2 is 4 times 7. Yun na yung answer natin. 28. Okay? So, pinakita ko dito na, Sir, paano pag hindi mahati? Hindi siya exact yung bilang. 7 lang sila eh. Sabi mo, divided by 2. O, oh, hindi siya. Paano mabilis? Doon ka maghati sa kabila. Pwede dito ang hati. Huwag mo nang hati yung 7. So, 1. Yun yung first. Plus. Yung last. 7. So, 8. Imbis na ito yung hati ko yung 7. Hindi mahati. Ang hinati ko na lang yung 8. Divided by 2. Kaya 4. Yung 7. Nandyan pa rin. So, 4 times 7. 28. Okay. Nakuha ba natin? Ayan ang gamit niyan. Okay. Pag hindi uh, exactly divisible by 2. Okay, number four. Okay. How about, what is the sum of 2, 4, 6, 8, up to 100? So, kailangan pa rin natin yung formula kasi 1 to 100 na naman. Mga even number ang tinatanong. Okay, so ano yung first term natin? First term is 2 plus, ano ang dulo? Yung last term natin is 100 multiply by 2. Kung ilan lahat sila. Ilan ba yung number, na even number from 2 to 100? Siyempre, kalahate. 50. Okay? Divided by yung constant natin natin. So, yan ang formula natin. So, 2 plus 100 is 102 times 50 divided by 2 is 25. Okay? So, itatimes na lang natin yan. 102. 2 times 25. So, 5 times 2 is 10. Carry 1. So, 1. 5 times 1 is 5. 2 times 2 is 4. 2 times 0 is 0. 2 times 1 is 2. Okay. So, 0, 5, 5, 2. So, ang answer natin is 2,500 Okay, so ulitin ko ulit para maintindihan nyo. Yung first term natin is 2, so yun yun, plus yung last term na 100. So, 2 plus 100, 102. Times 50. Saan ako yung 50? Kasi yung bilang nila, yung 2 to 100 na even number, 50 lang sila. Tapos, divided by 2 kasi nandun sa formula natin. Palagi di-divide sa 2. Ngayon, pwedeng i-divide sa 2 yung 50. Eksakto. So, 25. So, itatimes mo na lang itong dalawa. 102 times 25. So, 5 times 2 is 10. Carry 1. 5 times 0 is 0. So, may 1 doon. 5. 2 times 2 is 4. 2 times 0 is 0. Then, 2 times 1 is 2. So, 0. 5. 5. 2. So, so, ang answer natin is 2,550. Okay? 
So, mabilis ba? Okay, next. What is the sum of 1, 2, 5, 7, 9 up to 99? So, kung kanina, even number. Ngayon, add number naman. Okay, so kailangan natin yung first term. Anong first term natin is 1 plus yung last term natin is 99. Times, ilan lahat sila? Yung 1 to 99. Siyempre, 50 rin yung add number natin dito. Palaging constant yung 2. So, 1 plus 99 is 100. Times, ilan yung palahati ng 50? 25. So, magali lang mag times na may 0. Na 110, dadagdag mo lang. Bilang mo lang yung dalawang 0 ay 0. 1, 2, dalawa. So, dadagdag mo lang dun sa number na Madali yung number 5 kasi exact 100. So, una ulitin ko 1 kasi first Then, plus yung dulo 99 So, 1 plus 99 is 100 Times 50 So, mula ko yung 50 Kasi yung mga odd number 1, 3, 5, 7, 9 Up to 99 May 50 doon Kalahati yung odd Kalahati yung number 50 Divided by 2 Kasi doon sa formula natin na sa taas Kailangan yung i-divide sa 100 times 25 is 2,500. Sa high school, kailangan pa nila i-derive yung formula. Pero ito, direct ito, kasi sa mga grade 6, direct na yung mga kanil. Okay? Pang mental. So, ang kabayanan ulit at ang ating mga susunod na post para maging matuto sa math. Learn to love math. Till next time!